Hey guys, and welcome back to another Factorial Friday Facts discussion. Today I am joined by even more people, multiple of them you will probably uh, remember or recognize from elsewhere. So I guess, uh, I don't even remember everyone sitting here. We have Shred Guy, Scarhoof, Root Negative, Peter Taylor TX, Anominate, uh, Gepwin, and A Cry in Shame. Uh, several of these guys were with us last time, but yeah. Hey guys. Morning. Hey, everybody. Hello, everybody. Hey. I'd just like to point out who he mentioned first. That's because your name <laughs> is right above mine in the ordering. The, the, the alphabetical <laughs> arrangement is all that it did for you, right? Anyway, back on topic. So, yes. there's, yeah. There's so many people here, we need to keep going. Uh, alpha blending and pre multiplied alpha. Mm. So, yeah, we have like yeah. alien math stuff going on here that. I just don't understand. Math. I mean, red, green, blue. That's all the math stuff. It's it's really easy, right? So the, the colors, the colors in any image. So the red, the green, the blue, mm -hmm. and then the alpha is just how transparent it is. And all they're talking about is making the game look better. Okay, yeah. So they're making the game look better. We have some pictures of flames. Yeah. I just love this line where the you know alien math symbols, and as you can easily see, this means no, you no. <laughs> <laughs> where does it say this? <laughs> right under it's the right first there. alian the first math one. equation. You, you can, can easily see that the source with alpha zero will be fully transparent. It's like, oh wait, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't get yeah. it. I felt the same thing. <laughs> I felt the exact same thing. Yeah, yeah, just, it that's what it takes me back. Math. It takes me back to a college math class where it just says you can easily see here, and you go. Thanks. No. Thanks for telling me I'm an idiot. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's like it's like, the, it's like the whole like we were teaching like you taught math. It was like one plus one is two. Now find the salt. Now I'll solve for x. Yeah, pretty much. So in texture yeah. filtering. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, so I guess like yeah. on the left, like the most uh, leftmost flame image is. I don't. I don't know what that's representing, that's, but that's standard that's image. Right. Yeah, but yeah, that's no transparency. Yeah. Right, and then the one on the far right is like that's kind of like what we have now, isn't it? Yeah, I think that's <laughs> yeah. Well, that's that's the result. Yeah, of you know this pre-multiplied alpha. You got so, your R, your G, your B, and then your alpha. Right. So it seems like um, it seems like. The um, yeah, besides a slight performance gain from the GPU not having to do a bunch of multiplication all the time, this equation allows us to do some extra effects we couldn't do without pre multiplied pre multiplied alpha. So, from what it seems, a makes the game look a bit better, b lets them do more stuff. Sounds pretty good, yes, yeah, that's why it's good. I think that's a brilliant summation, yeah. I love all these little lot of optimizations that they do all together, mm, it's, they, they, they it's make actually it a lot better. Yeah, it's actually phenomenal the optimizations they do because they're yeah, it's crazy. They, like, they they go looking for the slightest improvement in the game, and then you know, even if it only gives a fraction of a percent, they're like, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, <laughs> let's improve it. Yeah, so they had mentioned before in a earlier Friday facts that their issue wasn't like one big thing lagging everything out. It was like death by a thousand cuts. Yeah, exactly. yeah. Well, of course, you've got 10 million items on screen at once. It's amazing to me that the game doesn't just crash outright every time I play it. <laughs> yeah, that's true. So, that's very true. You know, with, with the amount of moving things, yeah, that's right. Yeah. So heading down, I would say, at least for me, the most exciting part, um, rail-related things. So yeah. they've yep. kind of finished, I guess, what the improved rails are going to look like? Seems like more or less. It says there might be a couple of little tweaks but uh, I would like the new HD rails. That have, like you, you don't think about it, but when you if you see them like side by side with the rails you have now, it's a massive improvement. Oh yeah, yep. definitely. Yeah, having these all over your world is just going to look fantastic. Although I am like triggered to hell and back again, man. These signals. I pointed this out <laughs> to you guys, and the commenters, the people who watch this, can let let us know. But these leftmost two signals on this, uh, the far I'm more triggered thing. by this crane, man. I, no, I'm, I'm, I'm more. Is that completely like this. wonky? Why is there a chain <laughs> signal in the middle of the bottom rail? Like, what is that accomplishing? It's not going to do anything. 
Yeah, someone hasn't watched the uh, all the, the train tutorials that are out there on YouTube. That's that's yeah. not yeah. good uh, train <laughs> signal usage. <laughs> but but seriously, like these signals on the far left and even the other one that's like it, they just look like smashed or, or crooked. I mean, it looks like the if you look at the lines going into the lights, it, they're kind of at an angle. Yeah, so maybe that's the point. Is that they they kind of it, it looks like from... they had to move the lights slightly to make the new rails fit. And they just haven't mm. quite fixed everything yet. Because if you look at on the right, at the top right blue signal here, it's way further away from the track oh, yeah. than you'd think. It's like not even touching. And it's got this bit that looks like it's supposed to be abutting the track that's nowhere close to even the rocks. Oh, yeah. So I think they're yeah. just working out a few little movement issues with the new textures. Yeah, just a few offsets to tweak. I'm sure something they'll get sorted out. And you can see the, uh, the, the ones, the chain signals on the top right, they're not even aligned. They're actually one tile oh, offset yeah mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, this I'm image is so triggering power. yeah it really is <laughs> so i think it, it it pretty much reeks of just someone's gone and put together a demo pretty much but i mean it still looks fantastic i mean yeah i can't wait for this one sexy looking demo yeah yeah, yeah. They always do those lights. Stuff. I wonder <laughs> if those lights are leaning away because when a train goes by, if there's any debris on the tracks, it throws it away. So if your if your lights are leaning away from it, there's like a, a ramp to allow the debris to to kind of glance off of it rather than shattering your lights. Dude, if they put yeah. that much thought into it, <laughs> holy crap! <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I, I don't, don't know about you guys, but do do you guys remember when the inserters were like? A couple of, like they, they were literally flat and they looked like a couple of bits of paper mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> like compared to where we've come from pretty good oh yeah. i know anybody who started playing the game recently go back and look at the early early pictures because you will not believe <laughs> how far this has come yeah it's pretty there was actually somebody who went back and started playing one of the super early versions that was doing a stream of it where like the the belts didn't even look like belts. They were just blocked with arrows on them. Yeah, yeah. Hey. That's what it used to be. Yeah, so... Um, it's come a long way, that's for sure. No kidding. Yeah, I mean, really, it's another one that is... Uh, the train things are cool. Uh, other than that, I wouldn't say it's that great for discussion purposes. Um, so that's... Well, the only thing kind of I had was like, you're, you guys are poking at the, the signals, but if you look at the, the crossroad where it actually the two rails cross, I noticed there it's, it's not... like the, It looks like it's just two lines crossing rather than an actual rail set up. So it's probably something just added to the, you know, this is a demo thing, but it's something that I noticed underneath the, uh, the locomotive no, I, itself. I think that's actually what it's going to do, because the way, as I understand it, the way they kind of overlay rails that cross is they effectively have an order on which each element is kind of applied so you have you know the gravel goes underneath and then it puts all of the the, the, the ties the rail ties hmm. go on and then it puts the rail over the top so there's not a separate sprite that defines what a what it looks like when rails go over the top of each other it's just uh, the existing sprite textures overlaid yeah yeah because you wouldn't normally see this yeah. in real life right you wouldn't yeah, you'd see have a to, crisscross of well, rail you, signals. You rail might, signals. but you'd you'd have to add some like track T -junction. tires and things. No, like a T junction with rails just doesn't happen. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, <laughs> That's yeah, just not. How how often has anyone actually used this? I don't think I've ever made a T junction like in my game. I always use the yeah, use the roundabouts and. Yeah. I did very early on, and then it ended poorly wait so I've never <laughs> done whoa, it whoa, since. whoa 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 are you guys gonna be building roundabouts in this world because if you are i just need to go to a whole nother section of it well now now we're gonna get the oh. toilet tree well, I'm, I'm, you can. We and i think that, i think that that's probably a good place to to wind it up yeah i think this is probably good if, if anyone has any last thoughts i like trains i like trains very insightful all right <laughs> I think uh, I think that'll do it. As always, guys, thanks for watching. We'd love to hear your thoughts and discussion down below in the comments. But until next time, we will uh, catch you later. See you, everyone. Bye. 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 Bye.